Hey, hey, hey guys, welcome back. So today we're going to go over and review the XCH price situation and of course review Bitcoin and Ethereum, how it's standing in its own two feet right now. What's the current situation in the crypto market? And I'm going to provide you some updated news on what's going around in the crypto atmosphere in general. There's a few things that's going on that may be affecting Chia and how it's going to prosper in the coming future. So let's go over what I'm talking about. So current price of XCH right now is $41.50 obviously it has been coming back down on coin market cap it's ranked 139 today's low is 10.8 percent in the negative crypto bubble says we're negative 8.3 percent and was ranked 157 now that's not looking too good in comparison to the last two or three days crypto fear and greed index for bitcoin is saying that we're in extreme fear of 11 actually yesterday was even doing better but the price has been coming back down because we're sitting in the 19,000 again where it was actually hitting like 21 or 22 from what I've seen just within the 24 hours. Ethereum is borderline hitting that 900 mark again. Graph Chia is saying that we are at 22.85 EIBs for the net space and everything just seems to be pretty static as far as I can tell right now. So we go over to KuCoin trade volumes. Obviously, there are a lot more sales right now. We have, look at these sales, average price of 41.27, 129 XCH is for 3000 like almost $4,000, $4,000. It's continuing. Guys, look at this. Everyone is selling off their XCHs. You know, there was a few comments that I read. You guys were able to capitalize on this by buying it in the mid 20s or low 30s. And once it hit that 50, you guys practically doubled your money for most of you. And you guys, you know, made off great with that. Unfortunately, that didn't happen to everyone. So whoever commented and let me know that you actually did that, more props to you you that's the name of the game right you buy you sell you buy you sell and that's how it usually works so today i wanted to go over a few things that you can see i have a bunch of these tabs right now you know one thing i wanted to bring up was this article and there's a few more articles and i just want to do a comparison to how is chia going to compete in this space with this whole nft one now it hasn't been released yet officially and i'm still trying to figure out the chia nft one going to compete in this space with articles like this so let me just read it out to you i paid 50 dollars for a superhero bunny on coinbase's new nft marketplace and saw how it could give rivals like OpenSea a run for their money now OpenSea has been like probably the top pioneer in nft trading now coinbase is coming out with it gamestop has their own so how is chia's nft now you can see i, I just want to point out some of the differences and in, in my opinion so this is coinbase's nft website you can see it's very visual the visuals are just very bright and colorful you have gamestop's nft site and of course it's very straight to the point and direct and it actually shows you how to do all this now and then this is chia's website which is like i can't even change you know to night mode or dark mode on this and it's just like it's very blinding uh for them to explain what this whole chia nft is and you have your offer files all right the technology is great but i just think this website needs a better refresh the marketing team could probably do something with that now on other news bitcoin miner bitfarm sells coins after ending hodling so bitfarm is no longer hodling the bitcoins that they were planning to hold on for their life they actually sold 3,000 bitcoins for 62 million dollars over the past week to boost its liquidity amid the record-breaking bear market it's one of the first self-proclaimed bitcoin hoarding miners to turn away from accumulating mined coins so they're no longer holding their mined coins and just selling it off now to build liquidity because if it keeps on going down in the price of bitcoin it's going to be a problem for a lot of exchanges or a lot of miners right now because they can't afford to keep the operation running and if they're not profiting they have a huge risk of shutting down their farms so in other news hong kong film star Louis Ku sees Gene Storm poster image misappropriated by Chinese NFT platform. What they were actually saying here is that this NFT platform used his face or poster without any consent and just boosting the sales of this NFT saying that they had some association with the actor. And here you can see the G Storm poster starring Louis Ku. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
And that is Louis Koo in one of many action movies that he does in Hong Kong. Crypto in general, NFT, whatever it is, these guys are gonna so they're they're ruthless in taking you know public figures and using it without consent to publicize or promote their own projects just so they can get the money right in their hands. So don't always assume that because you see a famous face on a particular project that they're necessarily part of it. And in another topic, Pornhub parent company CEO and CEO are departing as scrutiny builds over alleged consensual content which is pretty crazy right so and may not have had consent and it was just published on their website for you to enjoy which is not a good thing because there is no consent then the people who were in it didn't allow for it or maybe you're not getting paid for it who knows so comment below let me know what you guys think about the whole xch price and if you enjoyed actually listening to other topics on news in regards to the whole crypto space, NFT space, whatever it is, I find relevant. So pretty much this video, I wanted to really compare like Chia's NFT one. How is that going to compare with OpenSea? How is that going to compare with the Coinbase NFT and the GameStop NFT? So let me know your thoughts on that. And again, I want to thank you guys for always being here. Please remember to hit that like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.